I am really hoping uh, this video works today. I think I may have solved the problem, but I don't want to <laughs> get ahead of myself. But it is very early in the morning, and I really couldn't sleep that much tonight because this whole camera video thing has been on my mind. But anyway, if you don't know what I'm talking about, <laughs> look at yesterday's videos. My camera was just uh, acting up, and it still is. But um, I'm hoping that I solved the problem. Anyway, I hope you are able to see what I did this morning. I used the resin is called Art and Glow. Uh, honestly, not the best of resins. Um, even though this may look really pretty, that resin is, has a lot of bubbles. And there goes my camera. Not focusing. But um, I did use the Arteza Micas again in Amethyst Purple, Crystal White. Copper. Yeah, so I wanted to make these two bigger guys. These are the biggest molds I have so far. Um, yeah, these are perfect coaster size. This actually looks like a phone case. Um, but you know, you can use it as a coaster. And so, yeah, I hope you enjoy that. I love, I've been meaning to make some more resin. I've just been a little uh, preoccupied with my phone situation and the video situation. So hopefully you see this and I will see you a little later with what we are doing today. Um, actually we're going to do a bloom on a 5x7 canvas. Okie dokie. Come on. Focus. Alright guys, I'll see you in a sec. Hey guys, I'm back and I'm more awake. I'm going to keep this very short and sweet today because girl I don't know if this is gonna work I got lucky with that first clip I don't know if this video is gonna take or not but very quickly and if it don't you know where this phone's going see this window right here right out it <laughs> it's gonna go right out of this four-story window just kidding anyway let me get back to this okay enough joking around. <laughs> all right so I got my coffee like I need any but anyway, so we're gonna do a bloom, okay? We are gonna use Lime Fizz, Intense Teal, and Sunshine. This is a five by seven canvas, all right? We're just gonna coat it with one of these colors, put a little bit down in the other two, and we're gonna put the salt topper. And really quick, it's the Amsterdam Titanium White with one teaspoon of that. And then you have the Floetrol that's already strained. And you have two and three quarter tablespoons. And then mix, mix, mix. And then it's kind of, it's going to be a little on the thick side, which is fine. You put a little in the center. And then basically you blow with your breath. And you just blow down and out. And then you get these really, really beautiful cells. Um, thanks, guys, for... A lot of you liked my video yesterday. Thank you so much. Um, those were all my blooms with my little voiceover. Um, just very quickly. One thing I did forget when you're doing resin, um, I just got lucky because I didn't cover my resin pieces. All right, you should cover it. And I'm just using this like little Tupperware I had in the house so that no dust or any particles, you know, anything could just fly in there. Um, yeah, so that is what we're doing, okay? And I will be back in a minute.
guys, I am back. Um, next time I do a bloom, I'm gonna see if I could do a, a slightly better camera angle when you actually see me um, blow down and out on the canvas. Um, yeah, because that was like an important part. You saw it, but it wasn't the best of angles. And the fact that I got any video at all, I am grateful. But I think you get the idea. Um, and I did blow a little bit more, just to spread a little bit, not too much. But yeah, that is what we got. And um, I hope you enjoyed that. Yeah, these are a lot of fun. And you don't need a lot, a lot of paint, which is great. Especially when you are using those small little rounds. Um, let me just get, let me get a couple. Yeah, you don't need a lot of paint for these guys whatsoever and I really this is actually yeah this is like one of my favorites this is I just love this one um, and N Naptime Creations also has she uses like um, what is it called the spray acrylic stuff uh, to make it shiny um, I forgot what it's called off the top of my head right now but uh, yeah on her channel I think she used two different I think it's one's called Triple Thick. It's like a gloss spray. Um, okay, so that's what she uses. I may just um, use what I have, which is uh, I have a couple. I do have the Liquitex uh, Medium and Varnish. Um, and I also have the Tri Art, so I may varnish those. I really like that. Yeah, so this is a really short and sweet, sweet video today. Sorry about that, because um, I know how much you guys love hearing me talk and talk and talk and talk. <laughs> but um, no, because some videos, you know, if I'm reviewing uh, products and stuff, or I drone on and on, I mean, either one. But anyway, yeah, I'm just like, I'm just worried about this video, girl. So, um, I'm trying to get my video in and no, I just want to show you guys the blooms and ooh, I kind of felt I feel so much better today that uh, this seems to be working. Um, hopefully it continues to do that. Basically I changed my SD card from the new one to the old one. Don't ask me, maybe that SD card got corrupted. I don't know. I tried a whole bunch of different things, but for right now, I am grateful that it is working. So, I hope you enjoy this beautiful bloom. Yeah, these are a lot of fun. And it's honestly, it's really, really easy with the Primal Flow because you don't need to mix anything except for the cell topper. And all you need is your own breath. And it, it takes a little practice. Um, like I said, to see how much like cell tupper to use, depending on the size of your canvas. Like the other, a couple of the other ones, I think that I had used too much cell tupper, and another one I thought I'll use too little. So again, the more you do it, the more you get used to it. Uh, you, you know, you kind of gauge of how much you need. But I just love how it just kind of runs through the yellow and the teal. And I love that lime fizz. So, yeah, that is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope everyone has a great day. If you could, if you want to, you could follow me on social media. The links are down below. And I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye, and have a great day.